Welcome to Johnny on Energy. Today we're going to be talking about sealing air leaks from the interior to the house to the exterior. And these are things you may not think about but can make a big difference. And throughout the videos you're going to see on the site, a lot of times we're going to talk about making sure that the heat we have inside the house stays within the house. We don't have airflow bringing cold air in or in the summer, in the case of the summertime, losing our air conditioning to a flow that's taking it to the exterior of the house. And there's all these places where these little holes and so forth can open up and allow air to flow. And on a windy day, you may actually experience that if you went up to an exterior wall outlet like this one and put your hand there, you could actually feel some small amount of air potentially even coming out of the sockets depending on you know the construction of the home and its age and so forth. Why does that occur? For a couple reasons. This is a box that gets put into the wall, more modern one and plastic one here. But when they cut the drywall in, you can have space around the sides of the box that are open. And there's big openings in the back that you knock out that allow the wiring to come through. So that goes through the drywall, back into the insulation, and depending how that's all fitted around there, opens this box up to the cold air that's hitting the exterior wall of the house, kind of getting behind the uh, insulation. So what we're going to put in is a pretty simple product. You can get it at your home center, you can get it online, you can get it at places like Walmart. These are socket sealers, and they're basically a piece of foam. This one's for an electrical outlet and this one's for a light switch. And what they're gonna do on the box is they're actually gonna cover up some of that exterior and seal the interior tightly also so we don't get that airflow. So this is really simple. Let's go ahead and put one in, uh, the two of them in quickly and just show you how that's done. All right, we're gonna start off by removing the uh, cover plate here from the electrical outlet. In this case, the power is not off. We're not gonna to touch any of the wiring in there. It's kinda of like if you were painting your walls, you would go ahead and do that. And you can see here that space we were talking about. I can slip a pretty big blade on that side of it. This is up against a two by four, but I've got a gap around this. It's open to that outside wall. I also have wiring spots on the inside where I'm coming across. So pretty simply, I'm gonna put this in place. Put this back on top. Take our mounting screw here, which it's a foam insulation, so this is gonna compress it back in. And there we go, we've insulated this socket for airflow and uh, something pretty much anybody can do who could use a screwdriver. All right, now for the uh, light switch right here. I've already removed the cover from this one to save us a little bit of time in the video. Again, we do have gaps and so forth similar to the other one. I'm going to put this and stretch it out over the little switch, get it in the place there, take my cover, and put the screw, two screws in that hold this into place. And there we are, we're all set. We've got the light switch covered, insulated to this exterior wall. So all you have to do now is go around, look around the exterior of your house and look at all your exterior walls, count up the number of outlets you have, the number of switch plates you have and so forth. Go to your, uh, you know, your local uh, home center or order them online or other locations like we talked about that are available. And all right, so we've insulated one outlet, we've insulated one switch cover. As you can see, super simple to do, very inexpensive, and if you can operate a screwdriver, you can cut back on all these leaks within your home. And like I said, you can pick up something like this, the socket sealers, available at your home center, available online. This one comes with uh, 18 outlets and six wall switches. So count up your wall switches, count up your outlets, and uh, go ahead and save yourself some air leaks for the summer and for the winter. Thank you for visiting Johnny on Energy. We hope to uh, see you back.